uh, most of the snake uh, will not attack people. If you see a snake in the wild, you can stay uh, within a safe distance to observe them. Most of the next snake uh, will be live uh, and leave you alone. In a compact metropolis like Hong Kong, not many of us come across snakes every day. Despite its small size though, the city has a high level of biodiversity, an impressive range of different species of plants and animal life. Snakes are the top predator within the habitats they are found in and play a key role in ecosystems functioning. The Agriculture, Fisheries and Conservation Department has been conducting surveys of the 52 snake species found in Hong Kong since 2002. We need to uh, build up a database for the snake because in the past there are no, uh, not much data for, for the snake uh, in Hong Kong. We will do some active searching, such as uh, turn over the uh, wooden board and turn over the boulders and uh, search for snake. Indeed, no rock is left unturned when recording snake species, their location and, whenever possible, their gender. The bamboo snake and greater green snake are the most common species found in Hong Kong. They cause some confusion as they resemble each other, but only one of them is dangerous. The bamboo snake is the venomous one and can be identified by its bright green scales, triangular-shaped head and orange-yellow eyes. Its non-venomous counterpart, the greater green snake, also has a glossy green back, but a rounder head. Spotting them can be a challenge for field officers like Ms. Tang, as they conduct a lot of research work at night, since most species are nocturnal. The snake is the top predator in the food chain. They can control the numbers of uh, insects, rats, and uh, even some frogs. They also they are the food of play of some uh, raptors, such as uh, serpent eagle. There are times when no snakes are recorded at all. The banded stream snake is a rare species that can be found in Sai Kung and Patsing Leng, but it has only been spotted a couple of times a year. Shed snake skins can tell a story too. If the skin is in good shape, it is possible to identify the species by counting how many rows of scales there are, their pattern, and whether they are keeled or smooth. Despite their fearsome reputation, Ms. Tang says snakes rarely attack people unprovoked, but she advises people to take note of the snake's appearance if they are bitten. You should stay calm. The most important thing is you, you must recognize the snake because there are different kinds of anti-venom. So if you are transferred to hospital, the doctor must ask you, what does the snake look like? More than 40% of Hong Kong's land area is protected green space. The Agriculture, Fisheries and Conservation Department enforces biodiversity conservation laws, carries out conservation action plans and organizes educational programs. One of the ways it does that is through the city's first biodiversity education centre, Woodside in Quarry Bay, which opened three years ago. There are many live display and also many specimens in this centre, so you can learn more about the Hong Kong biodiversity. Humans are only a small part of the overall population, and we need to do what we can to protect the rest. So the department joined forces with Green Groups to host Hong Kong's first Biodiversity Festival. The three-month event kicked off in September, with more than 120 activities aimed at teaching people more about nature and how to cherish it. The highlight will be the Biodiversity Carnival in Kowloon Park on November 15th.